Today on Dirt and Rocks, we're cleaning up what's left of a house that burned down. Uh, the backstory on this is that the house was being remodeled. Uh, something went wrong with the electrical and shorted out, caught the house on fire overnight, and this is all that's left. Our job is to just get in here, get the rest of this stuff loaded up into dump trucks, and get it hauled off to the landfill. Fortunately, we got our other job done pretty quickly. This morning, it was just the last little bit of clearing out for that pad site that we have to build next week. And since this job site is truly right on the way home, we just thought it'd be a good idea to go ahead and get in here and get done whatever we can. So we have a dumpster over there from the county. It's empty. And so the agreement was we could fill it up one time. So I'm just going to start slowly making my way over there. And then once we get there, we can start the process of getting the worst of the debris in there, especially the long stuff that won't fit the dump truck so well. And then we'll just go from there. Well, it's day two for our little project to clean up that burned down house. Uh, we just got a little rain shower this morning, but I don't think it's gonna be enough to hurt us. Um, there's a pretty decent rock base right there in front of where the house footprint was, so I think we'll be okay. But other than that, we're just gonna be loading trucks, hauling stuff to the landfill, and trying to get that lot cleaned up. Let's go. I don't even think I'm close to where I need to be with that truck, but we'll see how much reach we got. May just have to move it. You never know. Amazingly, this trash did not magically clean itself up. That right there is where I really want to be. Let's move the truck. That's better. A little bit more up in that front corner, and uh, I think this truck is good.
back to it. Well, the good news is, with any luck, maybe this trip and one more should get it all out of here. We're lucky. say this, I'm not going to miss the smell at the dump. Most of the time when we're there working, we're dumping brush, which is in a separate part of the landfill. And it's just brush up there, so there's no garbage. So it's not bad. You don't even really think about the fact that you're at a landfill. This stuff, it's got to go where all the garbage goes. Wow. Not great. From time to time, people ask me in the comments how I bid a particular job. You know, so for this one, there's really like three main components, which is the time that I spent on the excavator cleaning the property up, the time that we spend in the trucks hauling material to the landfill, and then the, uh, the fees at the landfill itself. So that's pretty much how I'm looking at this one. It's just looking at the hourly rates of each piece of equipment and how many hours did we actually use it. Obviously, we're not going to charge for the excavator just sitting here turned off while we're running back and forth to the dump. But you know, we did use it the first day, really just consolidating all the piles and everything like that so mostly it's just the trucking time and then whatever they charge us at the landfill is whatever they charge us at the landfill there's not much you can do about that you can kind of estimate it. I mean, we're averaging probably, I think we're averaging about four tons per uh, load. Some are running a little heavier, some are running a little lighter. It just depends on how much brush and how much dirt is in a particular load. this one in just before sunset I think it turned out pretty good there's a really mushy spot right there so I'm just gonna leave that little bit of brush piled up on top of it just to make sure nobody tries to drive over it or walk on it or anything until it dries out this ended up working out pretty good we ended up taking uh, 13 loads out of here I think 13 single axle loads and uh, got it all out of here to the landfill so yeah pretty much all the debris gone it looks good it's ready for whatever it's going to become in the future. We appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you on the next video.